The Fate of Pep Guardiola vs Thomas Tuchel Thomas Tuchel once blocked Pep Guardiola's way in the quarterfinals of the Champions League 2022-23 when Bayern met Man City. Therefore, those who love the Grey Lobster think that this team wants to appoint Tuchel to play against Pep in Europe's number one playground. In fact, these two military leaders pumped up resentment. And one can divide it into two periods to talk about the half-fights between two of the world's most gifted strategists, before and after Duchel's arrival at Chelsea. The first time Pep and Duchel faced each other on the bench was when Bayern faced Mainz in the Bundesliga in October 2013. At that time, Pep's Grey Lobster beat Duchel's Mainz 4-1 with goals from Arjen Robin, Thomas Muller, and Mario Mandzukic. In the match five months later, it was still Pep who won because at that time Bayern were winning not only in Germany but also the best team in Europe. However, in that 2013-14 season, Tuchel made a strong impression when he brought a German middleweight team to 7th place in the Bundesliga. It was a springboard for the 49-year-old leader to be recruited by Dortmund after five seasons with Mainz. Before taking the job, Tuchel spent time discussing tactics with Pep in a restaurant in Munich. The two have respected each other even as Duchel's Dortmund threatened to dethrone Bayern from the Bundesliga in 2015-16. However, after three clashes on the bench, Pep's Bayern still dominated with one win, one draw in the Bundesliga, one victory after a penalty shootout in the 2016 German Cup final. Plus, after five meetings before Pep came to lead Man City, he was unbeaten against Duchel. However, everything changed when the German military leader suddenly sat in the hot seat of Chelsea at the end of January 2021. Before Tuchel returned, the Blues only won two, drew one, and lost six in the last nine confrontations with Man City. And the two rematch when Chelsea face Man City in the semi-finals of the FA Cup. Hakim Ziyech's only goal helped the Blues win tickets to the final, ending Guardiola's men's hopes of winning a historic treble. This is also Duchel's first victory when facing Pep on the coaching bench. In May 2021, Duchel continued to rub salt into Pep's wounds by defeating the Spaniard 2-1 at the Etihad in the Premier League. Fortunately, the citizens still won the Premier League. But apparently, Duchel has found a way to beat Guardiola. That is further evidenced in another fierce and worth-watching battle between them. Two years ago, when Man City was on the road to the first Champions League title in history, by the time before the Champions League final 2021, Man City had an excellent journey, then Duchel beat Guardiola. The citizens disillusioned with the championship, and Pep once again missed an appointment with a big ear cup that he had never touched after being crowned with Barcelona. Before Duchel was suddenly sacked by Chelsea in September 2022, they also clashed twice in the Premier League and Pep's Man City won at least 1-0. Thus, a total of the two met each other ten times on the steering bench. Pep won overwhelmingly with six times, compared to Duchel only three times. But, the most important title belongs to Duchel, winner of the Champions League 2020-21. And now the eternal rivalry between Duchel and Guardiola has a new chapter following the sacking of Bayern's Julian Nagelsmann.